lots of great ones. But the most important one is the application did finish launching with options. This is the one that's called once the app is loaded and gone through its startup process. It calls this uh, message. It sends out this message, calls this method on the delegate object to say, hey, go ahead and start. I'm, I'm finished launching. Go ahead and do your thing. And if you notice in our code, um, that is what you're looking at here. You're looking at the application delegate, right? It's following the protocol right here, the application delegate. It's an S object. And these are all, these in the template, this actually has all the various uh, important messages that the application delegate would receive throughout the, throughout the life cycle, right? So you've got did finish launching, resign active, enter background, enter foreground. You can read about these and we'll actually get into these eventually in our future tutorials. So in our next tutorial where we start to talk about more about views and viewer hierarchies and more things you can do with views, we're going to get into actually using uh, the did finish launching. Uh, we're actually going to be putting some code in here and you'll get to see that anything we put in here actually happens at launch. So that's the delegate, and that's the interface builder. That's, so you're specifying the delegate, and you're, it's pointing, you know, to that class. So if I, you know, highlight over this, you'll see it highlights the Hello Coco Touch app delegate object, and that object interface builder is of type Hello Coco Touch app delegate. You know, this, if you go into the inspector up here in the info, you'll see class class identity. This specifies that the class for this object interface builder is a is called Hello Coco Touch App Delegate, and this is the class for it, right here. So that's how it all ties together. That's how it gets all called through, and that's the App Delegate. And uh, so this, that's kind of the concept. So you'll see delegates once again as a, as, a, as a constant design pattern. You're going to see as we go through and do iOS development, you're going to see delegates everywhere. That's very important. So once again, that's the first tutorial that we got into making our first app. Um, one of the quick things is if, if you were to build this for, you can actually build this for your device, very simply. So like right now my phone's connected. We went through, we already did the profile stuff. If we were to basically go over here and just change this to device and say build, um, we'll see it compile for the device, no problem. Build and run, and then you install the provisioning profile, and it goes through and installs the actual app on your device and runs it. So. You can actually do that if you'd like, and you can see this app run on your device and do the exact same thing we just saw it do in the simulator. So anyway, next tutorial, we'll get into some more fun stuff. We'll start getting into views and adding more views to the, to the window and, and talk about those. So see you guys in the next tutorial. Thanks.